The aims of the exercise is to develop the horse's footwork in the canter. And this is by using raised poles, so he starts to respect the poles and develop a pattern and a stride and a rhythm within his canter. So basically I've got three poles, or two sets of three poles rather. I'm using square poles and also raised round poles, so using the variations of both. And here we have a young horse doing this for the very first time, having a little look, thinking about where he's putting his feet. And you can see it really has a good effect on his hind leg in the canter. Coming from the other direction again, you see the rider has to work hard, which is exactly what you're going to have to do here with the inside leg to keep him upright and make sure he stays very symmetrical and straight in his balance. You see again, he makes real good use of his hind leg here through these poles. What you have to do here is as the horse opens itself a little bit over the poles, you have to land and shorten the canter up a little bit again for the next set of poles so the horse is always in balance. So what we're using here is two cavalettis, but we're using it for a change of direction for a horse for the very first time. So you don't need to use cavalettis, you can use little fences, but keep them about 3.2 metres apart and just allow the horse to work out, like it's doing here, what it's got to do with its feet. The event horse has always got to look and think about its feet and how to use them. And here we see the rider being really supportive with her right leg, right rein, and the horse there makes a lovely change of direction and a change of lead. And the same here to the other direction. You can see there how he makes a really good change with his legs. This shows you how he changes well on the right, but on the left he's losing his balance and he doesn't make that change. The most important thing here with a young horse is helping them a little bit. Make sure that you keep them in a good quality canter, keep them balanced and make sure that you are reactive. Always look to the next direction and make sure you keep your balance good.